I'm back with another haul, uh, three weeks in a row. Today it is new look, so we're getting a little bit more pricey, but not really high street. Um, as you know, my two favourite stores are Primark and New Look, and I haven't done like a massive New Look haul, literally, probably since January, when I kind of bought some stuff for school time and kind of for spring and summer, and now I'm buying some stuff for, again, for school and for autumn and winter, and it came to quite a lot, but that is the reason because it's still cheaper than if you go to Topshop, but I bought some staples in there, there was also an offer on if you spend £100 you got £25 off um, and I'm pretty sure that deal's gone now. I think it was for the bank holiday weekend but if you are a student you can get 10% off if you have uni days or a nurse voucher. I do usually use that but then the £25 off kind of worked better. Um, so yeah, I'm going to show you what I've got. So first of all I bought a school bag. Now I tend to like to buy a school bag every single year. Um, the one I actually used last year I had for, I want to say one and a half years. And it's still in perfect shape. It's like this grey tote and again it's from New Look. But the handles are kind of wearing off. So I just wanted a new one and I kind of wanted a bigger bag. Because I go to work straight after school I tend to have to take two bags to school with me every day. And I don't really want that. So I got this gorgeous bag that was £23. Which is amazing for what it is. It is faux suede and it looks so good. I am so into suede at the minute. Um, I want a suede jacket and I want a suede skirt. But they just don't really suit me. Um, but I'd really want one. Uh, so yeah, this bag is so nice. And it's, um, you got like silver chain and black. So it's perfect to go on your arm but then also on your shoulder which I kind of prefer. Um, and for A4 wise you can either stand them up or lie them down, that's how big the bag is. Inside, it's not 100% secure. I do usually prefer a zip, um, but there's not actually many bags now that are big with a zip. So it's just kind of like got a button in the middle, and then, I mean, it's all black inside, and then you get a, just a little pocket, and then you get your standard zip. Um, the only thing about suede is when it rains, it could get damaged. So what you can do is, um, you, you can find like a spray, and it's usually what you like, you spray, spray on shoes and so I'm going to spray that all over um, so hopefully that will kind of stay good. So next I'm going to go with two items that I got in the sale um, because yeah they're having like their big summer clear out sale but the items I got are kind of they're going to be good for school as well uh, because now my dress code is still smart like casual but any colour. So I've got this top that you saw me you wear in the last video. Um, it was originally... Yeah and by the way I bought all this online um, because I just like... When I went into the new look shops, there was nothing really because it was all sale stuff. So for all the new stuff, I went online and it was originally £12.99, but I got it for £6. So £7 off, amazing saving, saving, saving. Yeah, this khaki t-shirt, but then at the sides, you've got this lace pattern. So it kind of, you can adjust it to like if you want it tight or loose. Um, and I love it so much. It's just... That thing where you can wear with like black jeans, black leggings and a leather jacket and it would just like, it would just look an amazing outfit. Um, yeah, I really like that. And the other thing was originally, it was, I can't find it, my blind. It was originally 8 99 and I got it for £4 and it's just like deep pink. It's inside out. Great, it's because I would already worn them. Um, deep pink kind of, it's a v-neck t-shirt. But then it's like got these like spaghetti tie straps and that. So you think it's off the shoulder, but it's not. You kind of wear it. So yeah, the straps are like here and the shoulder starts about here. She's got a little gap. The only bad thing is these when on, these straps are really loose, as you can see in the clip. Um, so what I'm just going to do is kind of, well, my mum's going to do it for me because I can't sew. Going to kind of just like sew it down so it kind of fits a bit better. And again, they had them in all colours, but as it's in sale. They could have sold out by now. So I also got a few more t-shirts. So a t-shirt that I wore in my Primark call I did two weeks ago. Um, it was just this plain uh, mustard yellow, which um, I've always wanted to wear mustard yellow, but I, I think I only own one thing, and it's the perfect awesome colour. And it's just, yeah, this simple kind of 
tight t-shirt but it is still quite loose on me um, and I really like it and this was I feel like it was yeah it was 4 99 and they had this in so many colours I want to say they had it in green red blue black grey white every single colour possible so I got another top which was a bit more pricey but only at £10 so um yeah and this was so stunning and um I think I got like the last six online so it was obviously this isn't their new stock but it was obviously popular but they still had other sizes um, and it's perfect for school and it's just this grey t-shirt but look how nice the pattern on the shoulders is it's just got like this black lace pattern and it's so nice when on it kind of just sits below like your jean or leggings line yeah like your waistline so it's cropped but like not so you can see skin so again it's perfect for autumn um, and winter um yeah i really like it and it's really sophisticated but casual at the same time so the next item is a pair of school trousers now like i said we can kind of wear any style of trousers but as i've kind of got a few more casualties i want you to kind of get some smarter like the traditional trousers but still slim leg i have a pair that i got two years ago but i currently wear that when i volunteer at the curb so i don't want them to get ruined because they fit perfectly for that so i wanted a new pair now my dilemma was i went on the website and then two days later i went on again to actually buy the item and it all completely sold out then i noticed they had it in the petite style so i went for the size eight um and yeah my only issue is they are a little short on the leg but then when you have socks on and boots in the winter you probably won't be able to notice anyway they are these just plain zip trousers but again they're that smart school material but they go in and they're slim leg so win-win um and there is three zips but only two of them open but i love that because that's what they think all the trousers i own that i used for school last year none of zips which is so annoying whereas this is just perfect you know to fit chewing gum pads because it's always great to have them in your pocket um tissues even you I, I don't actually know if a phone would fit in there it's kind of that deep depending how big your phone is um yeah and these were 20 pound so a little bit more expensive but then the that thing that gonna last you all year round they also had them um in the tall so they've got kind of the petite and the tall versions left and my finger left for last because my favorite thing i showed you at the beginning and my other favorite thing i've left for last it is another suede thing here they are and they're these boots and i love them so much um as you can tell i'm really liking suede but my issue was um, I wanted to buy some Primark, some in Primark, um, because they were a lot cheaper. They were £18 in Primark, but they didn't have my size. They had like a four and a six, but I'm five, and they kind of just, the style didn't suit me that well. So I had to pay out £45, which is loads, but because I got the £25 off discount, because um, it was a, if you spend £100, you get £25 off. The way I look at it is I've got £25 off these boots, so I've only spent £20 for them which I think is a great deal. So they're these over the knee boots. Now, if you look online, they didn't have as many in store. Um, I actually tried them on in store, but then I bought them online. Um, they have like, I wanna say about eight different styles. They have so many different like lengths of heel. I have just got the smallest one, it's almost flat. And the reason this is because I wanna wear them to school, I wanna wear them for days out, but also evening times. So if I got like a massive heel, it wouldn't be ideal for like days out. Um, they've just got zips, which kind of help you um, when you're kind of shoving your foot down if you need help. Um, and they're really sturdy at the bottom. They are a little bit slippy, but only a tense bit. They've still got quite a good grip. And yeah, they've just got laces on the back to tighten it if they are a bit too loose on your leg. And the only problem is, is you definitely need to wear thick socks because if you don't, which I will intend to in the autumn and winter, um, the zip kind of pokes out a bit, um, which is a little annoying. But I suppose if you've kind of got a bit bigger, wider legs, I have quite got some thin legs. But if you kind of have a bit wider ankles anyway, it shouldn't be a problem. And I'm very small, but they probably fit about halfway up my thigh so if you are a lot taller than me they will fit over your knee where they're meant to and if you're smaller than me they'll go up your thigh and ball and I don't think it really matters when it comes to these boots kind of what height they are and yet yeah, they look I just I love them so much when they're on again I'm going to need to spray them with spray so they don't get ruined and um, these are yeah like I said perfect for casual put nights out as well and not that I go on any nights out but I mean if you do um but casual and smart and whatever the reason why i got inspiration from these is because when i was like young as i'm like 
eight years old. I used to have over the knee boots and then they went out of fashion and then they've come back in probably within the last year or so. And Saffron Barker has a pair that she always wears and she's worn them through the summer, which I wouldn't do, but they always look so nice on, so I really wanted a pair. And yeah, they're just a bit of a change from ankle boots, what I usually wear. And yeah, and they're really soft as well, which makes it even better. And even though they're £45, pound, they're still a lot cheaper than what a branded pair would be or in Topshop. I imagine in Topshop they're probably like 80 And again, this is faux suede. It's not real suede. So there's my haul. Um, so as you can see, I have got staples that are like, going to last me. I've got boots that are going to last me, hopefully for like a few winters to come. And then I've got a bag that will last me all year um, for school and trousers that will last me all year and tops. So I feel like it warranted well and I didn't overbuy because usually that's what I do when I go online. I buy stuff I don't need but I feel like all that stuff I would definitely get good use out of. If you're new remember to subscribe, like and your comment of the day can be what are you most looking forward to wearing in the August the winter period? Kind of like jumpers, boots or what colours you're most looking forward to. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.